Hi, I'm Jane from Poppy Patchwork and welcome to my quilt block series. In each of these videos I'm going to show you how to make a different block and they're all going to measure 12 inches. I hope you like this video, if you do click the like button and please let me know in the comment section below what other videos you'd like me to make. Let's get quilting. This is my quilt block notebook and it's available on Amazon. The links are in the comment section below. And if you click on the link above, it'll take you to my video all about it. Today, I'm going to show you how to make Coxie's Camp Quilt Block. And these are instructions for a 12 inch block. And if you'd like to know how to use this block in a quilt, please watch to the end of this video where I've got some illustrations to show you how to use it. You will need four two by six and a half inch strips in background fabric, two two and five eighth inch squares, two two and five eighth inch squares in fabric A, four three and a half inch squares in fabric A, four two by six and a half inch strips in fabric B, two four inch squares in fabric B. Making the four patch economy square. Use the two and five eighth inch squares in background fabric and fabric A. Place opposite fabrics right sides together, then pin and sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. As shown here. Press the seams towards the darker fabric. Nest the seams together and pin along the long edge, then sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. As shown here. Press the seams to one side. Adding the triangles, use the 4 inch squares in fabric B. Cut in half across the diagonal. As shown here. And repeat with both squares. Place the two triangles on opposite sides of the four patch. Handle carefully as the cuts are on the bias and they can stretch easily. Pin as shown, matching the point on the triangle with the seam on the four patch. Sew with a quarter inch seam allowance as shown. Press seams towards the triangles. And then trim as shown. Place the other two triangles on the other sides of the four patch. Pin and sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. As shown here. 
press towards the triangles. And then trim the economy square. Trim to a quarter inch seam allowance at the triangle points. Making the strip sets. Use the strips in background fabric and fabric B. Place opposite fabrics right sides together then pin and sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. Press the seam towards the dark fabric. Repeat to make four strip sets. Block layout. Press your unit and lay in the block layout. Pin the bottom row units together. And then the top row units. Then sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. Return to the block layout. Press seams in the direction shown. Pin the left and right columns to the centre column and then sew with a quarter inch seam allowance. Return to the block layout and press your seams. Congratulations, you have made the Coxie's Camp quilt block. Here are some quilt options. This is an illustration of the quilt repeating the same block. There is no sashing or borders, but the use of the white background fabric in the block allows the design and fabrics to stand out. This is an illustration of the quilt repeating the same block placed on point. There is no sashing or borders, but you would need to add blocks in background fabric in between the blocks shown here with the stars and use setting triangles around the edges again shown here with the stars. This is an illustration of the quilt repeating the same block but with sashing, cornerstones and borders. And finally this is an illustration of a sampler quilt using some of the blocks from this quilt block series. The sashing in this quilt is in the white background fabric. The cornerstones and border is in a darker fabric to pop and frame the quilt. Want to learn more? Watch another one of my videos from the Quilt Block series. Click above to go to my playlist. I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. More of these videos will be posted, so please tune in. Thank you for watching and bye for now!